Hello viewers, how are you? Today we are going to see about how to download SRTM DM search meter resolution from USGS uh, Explorer. So uh, just uh, go to Google and write ARS, ARS Explorer. ARS Explorer. Then click on it. So such types of links are coming. So you, you are uh, required to click on the first uh, link as you can see here, Earth Explorer. This interface is uh, coming. So Earth Explorer manage criteria. That means there is a search criteria, data sets, additional criteria. If you uh, there is search criteria. So uh, if you uh, want to refine more or further your uh, data sets, you are required to uh, use additional criteria than results. So as you can see, uh, this is the uh, interface uh, USGS uh, uh, Explorer. Uh, so many kinds of data are available here. But today our target is uh, how to download DM, SRTM DM uh, 30 meter resolution, uh, which is a high resolution product of the entire group. So first, uh, in order to access or in order to download any types of data from uh, this website, you need to go to uh, login. Uh, I have already login. I have an account with this site, so I have already uh, login. But if you do not have an account, uh, uh, let us click on this and see. So such kinds of interfaces will come. So if you have already an account, uh, you are going to enter the username and the password. But if you, if you are the first time to visit this site, you are going to uh, create a new account. So you need to go to username, uh, password, then continue, uh, then based on the, the requirement of passwords and uh, username criteria, uh, you will direct, uh, redirect it to this page. So, uh, the first one is, as uh, I told you earlier, uh, uh, the, first, the first step is uh, search criteria. That means enter your search uh, criteria. This is the option how to, how to access uh, any types of data, including uh, today's TMs, SRTM search meter resolution. This is your coder. Uh, this is KML. A geocoder means just uh, clicking the, ta the, ta the target area, what you want, uh, and accessing the data. Or in another option, you, ca you, are going, uh, you, you can go to KML or shapefile upload. So if you have a study area, a watershed area, or any types of project area, or any types of area of interest, uh, you need to uh, convert first uh, into KML or uh, Shapefile. So two, uh, two extensions of data types uh, were required. So if you select this uh, option, uh, uh, it redirects to select file. Then you are going to select from your, uh, select from your uh, uh, folder and uh, upload it. Then uh, the, po the polygon or the KMZ or the KML file directory comes to this. But uh, in my case, I wanted to just uh, draw uh, a rectangle around in my interest area. So I would like to uh, select the first option. So I am going to uh, geocoder, then features or genes. Uh, I want to browse my. Uh, my target area just go, go to my uh, interest area my case let 
this will lift us on this so let me click here uh, one click here one click here one click just for uh, click so for coordinates will come for coordinates or four points will come I make a rectangle let's say this is my study area so I want to download the DM or the digital elevation uh, model of the this area this area then the four uh, corners of the four coordinates are already known already come so I would like to go to the, uh, the data sets data data sets so i want to just uh, go to as you can see so many types of data are available area photography uh, communication satellites classification data so uh, my target is uh, uh, digital elevation if you go to directly to digital elevation then you will get as a bottom corner you will get srtm after the SRTM, so uh, one, two, three, four, uh, four, option, uh, four options are available. But the first one, SRTM, one arc uh, second global. This is the high resolution product of the entire group. That means 30 meter DM resolution. So you need to select this. You need to select this product. Then click, click on results. Click on results searching. Good. So two types of uh, scenes or data sets are available. I want to uh, select which one is covering the entire uh, study area of my interest. So for example, let me uh, show the footprint. Okay. Just a little bit remains from my uh, study area, so it is uh, good. Okay, so let me check. Let me uncheck this and check the second uh, product. Only it accommodates a little bit of my study area, so I would like to, I would like to uh, select the first one, the first one, but. If you are in critical study or if you are in a research project, uh, you can uh, check all the products. So if you need this corner or if you need this the remaining area, you need to go to, you need to download all the results and mosaic them or composite them. After mosaic and composite them, you can, you can uh, extract your study area. But this purpose, I don't want to. Uh, I don't need the second product, so I would like to uh, download the first one. This is a foot, the footprint how it covers, and the second option shows show browse overlay. That means you will see the imagery, or you will see the digital elevation model, or the DM data that overlays on your study area. So let us click, for example, on this. Okay, let us wait. Let us wait. The DM is coming. Overlaying your study area. Uh, download options. Then you need to click once. Click once. Loading download options. Let's wait the results. So, uh, three types of options are uh, coming. Always you would like to. Uh, take care about the formats so download GOT for one arc second 24.76 megabytes then click on download product okay querying info okay let us download this is by the way uh, my uh, download application it is called free download manager the bit it is uh, another uh, best uh, download manager then download yeah it is completed so let us find 
are the, the downloaded DAM data. Here is the DAM data to the, this amount of megabyte size. So let us uh, rename it DAM 30 meters. 30 meters. DM 30 meters. Let me copy it and take to my folder. Let me put here D. Okay. Let me open my arc map. Open D. DM 30. Yeah, this is the DM data of the DM data that I downloaded from USGS. So this is the 30 meter resolution that I already downloaded from the uh, USGS. Uh, if you like this video, please share, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.